Sweet. Brian. All right. Thanks. Thanks for being our first Frisky Boathouse guest, thank starting you, it thank, off. Thank you for having Super me. Super excited. Always a pleasure. Awesome. And you guys are family, so. Oh, awesome. Definitely. Yeah. Well, sweet. Um, looking at, like, your year, it seems like it's been a very busy, successful year for you. Um, it seems like you're always, you've done a lot of touring, mm. been Meteorite, Meteorite Man, mm. album, like some good big EPs. So how are you feeling now? How do you feel I about feel, the year? Yeah, I feel great. I mean, it's been um, slowly building up throughout the years and uh, I'm just enjoying the process, you know, and there's no um, specific point where I feel like uh, I should get to. It's just really just uh, going with the flow and enjoying uh, what I'm doing yeah. the most possible. So, um, so far it's been really nice. Uh, I've gotten the chance to go to amazing places and just share the music in the way I'd like to share it. So I'm really happy, That's really, awesome. really happy. Yeah. What does that mean to you to share it in the way that you want to share it? Well, present it in the way that I like to present it, you know, in, in good venues and, and uh, to the right people. Um, we're very particular with where I play and, and, and how it's done with who, okay. always, you know, who is associated, who understands the music that I'm presenting, which is not necessarily the trendy stuff, the trendy music is more of a, um, it's a bit beyond that. So uh, the people that understand that and, and, and the venues that are open to that are the people that I, I usually like to uh, present the music, you know, yeah. so it can be properly, you know, it's almost like, uh, if you think about it, it's almost like watching a, a very hi-fi movie in the proper theater. Sure. Rather than watching it, you know, Absolutely. on your phone. Right? Yeah. So that's what I mean by present it properly. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah. And you feel like you've, this year has been a good year for that for you? Yeah, like. for sure. Like the music uh, that I do is, um, it requires, you know, a nice big sound system and the right environment for, for it to be perceived how it's, it was written. Gotcha. So, to us, that's priority always. Um, did uh, is there a new place like anywhere new you went to this year? New country? Uh, let's see. Um, yeah. Um, oh gosh, I have to think. Um, there's been a. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, always new places. I just came from uh, Sarajevo, but I, do, I was just oh, wow. there um, about a year ago. But yeah, I mean, I had an India. Oh, Australia. Yes. Oh, yeah? Yes, yes. Sorry. I just, I just came from Australia. Beautiful um, city, uh, Brisbane and, um, and uh, Sydney. Uh, amazing energy. It was really pleasant to be there because uh, it was a place that... Um, I've been um, I've been wanting to go, but we were just waiting for the right time, and this was the right time. Yeah, and there's other places that I can't really remember now, but, <laughs> but they're all special. They're yeah. all very special, yeah. and I really value each one of them. There's uh, a lot of people ask me, "What's your favorite city? What's your favorite yeah. place?" You know, it's really hard to answer that question because each place has its own personality, and and um, it would not be fair to just pick one over the other one because you have to understand um, what is the city going through, what have they gone through, where are they standing with uh, uh, in, in a in in an educational um, yeah. uh, side as uh, as far as music, and then from there you're able to see. Uh, um, for, for, from there, you're able to appreciate uh, the city right? Or the, and the people Yeah. based on that. You cannot compare it ever with another city because they have another history. Yeah. And, um, and, and when you understand that, then each place becomes very special. Yeah, yeah. That. that makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Um, do you have like a, a 
a favorite. I know you probably just as you just said, but maybe just one one of your favorite moments from this year, um, like a night that surprised you or something that's really stuck with you. That's kind of representing. Yeah. Many, many of them, but I've always, I think New York is always yeah. going to be for me the place. Mm -hmm. uh, not only because I'm from there, but because the energy that I feel and, and, um, and the people and, and just everything combined becomes ex explosive, you know, it becomes a, a big explosion of joy and, and, and high energy. So uh, I would always pick New York <laughs> <laughs> as long as they keep doing that. But uh, yeah, but a, a lot of beautiful places, San Francisco, uh, uh, Los Angeles uh, and Miami. Um, Argentina, of course, um, places like India was really nice now recently. Uh, we did our first endangered showcase there in uh, Bangalore, and sorry, in Hyderabad, and uh, it was really nice. So, yeah, these are all really places that st stick up. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Um, so, the endangered showcase, actually, I want to hear more. You said you just started doing those. Mm -hmm. This year, I kind of hear more about what Endangered is all about. Um, yeah. Well, Endangered is, um, it started many years ago as a, more of an intimate uh, showcase in Miami. We did oh. a few in our Basel and, and for Winter Music Conference, um, or Miami Music Week, like people call it now. <laughs> yeah. Um, and it started just as a party, then it became a label. And as the label started growing and um, a lot of the producers and artists that have been um, sending music, have they, they send music according to the sound that I have kind of created. And so it's becoming this big family. And then uh, so we're at a point now that it's time for us to... Um, do showcases, but the showcases are not just, you know, a normal regular night where uh, we have some of the artists and that's it. Like there's a lot um, involved. There's a lot of art that is being okay. uh, incorporated. Um, there's visual art, uh, you know, the feel of the place. We take a lot of, we put a lot of effort uh, uh, to make sure that uh, the place is really um, fitting to to this world that we are creating, which is like a futuristic, out of this world environment, <laughs> where you're able to experience music at a just at another level. You know, um, the environment uh, invokes you to. Uh, really uh, get really deep into the music, mm. you know, low lights, not too much flashes, mm -hmm. you know, very intimate and, and warm. And this allows you to really get into the music that we're presenting, which is very powerful. Uh, it's not simply just melodic, uh, progressive and, 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 and techno and, and all these things. This music has a, a, a lot of uh, spiritual value to it. And it can become a spiritual experience, you know. And for us, this is what endangered us. It's really an experience, you know, rather than just a party. You yeah. can come out of there feeling empowered and beautiful and, <laughs> and, and uh, with, with uh, a lot of your questions answered, <laughs> you know. And maybe new questions. Yeah. So... Um, this is uh, the effect that we want to create with Endangered, and it, it's, it's working. We, we've done some um, showcases in New York already. In Miami, we continue to do so. Uh, we've uh, done just one recently in Toronto, uh, and uh, one in India as well, and we have many coming up. So this is a project that I'm really putting a lot of love and effort into it just because it keeps me... This is the one project that is keeping me excited. And, nice. and uh, um, yeah, it's just my baby, you know? <laughs> and I have an amazing, beautiful team uh, uh, behind it. You know, I have a whole team that is taking care of a lot of things. So it's a really good flow. 
and we're very pleased with how it's going and it's only going to get bigger and bigger yeah yeah it's rolling it's oh, very yeah. exciting yeah. yeah we have so much so many ideas and so many things it's just a different take on what a regular party could be like let's not just have a regular party let's have an experience mm -hmm. a true a meaningful experience that could maybe even change your life you know for the good so yeah this is what endangered is yeah <laughs> that's awesome i mean that seems like your um your goal as an artist you know put out into event form or you know your goal of like having people question things and get answers to things and yeah and a lot of people ask me the meaning of endangered i think it will be uh fitting for me to say what endangered really is why endangered people ask me why endangered what is the endangered is actually um the step right before extinction <laughs> right so any creature that has that it becomes endangered is because it's just about to become extinct but if you think about it that creature has developed at its best in this point of time it's the best it could ever be right you know and uh, it has evolved to the highest point and this is what endangered is the evolution of us as the highest point we can ever be the 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 highest um um uh, level i guess of evolution Love that's it. what endangered that's is. awesome yeah <laughs> <laughs> so um what are you most proud of so far in your music in my music, in your music. Well, in my music in general. Yeah, your music, your career, yeah. your life, your music life. I don't know. What are you most? Proud I'm proud of? of the sound that I created and the sound that I've that that I, I'm known to give. I feel like. It's a very unique, particular sound that it doesn't come from any particular influence other than life, and it's my own and take. It's, your, yeah. it's my own take on it. It's not inspired on other sounds, on other melodies, on other things. It's really inspired on my perception of life, you know. I get inspired from, from a flower, from a mountain, from, from water, from something that I see and experience. This, and then this turns into uh, an, an expressive emotion in sound. And, and then I, I get to share that and 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 present you with that picture and if this causes a positive reaction in you then that's what i'm proud of that's awesome i think that's the most you can like hope for in life to express what you see your unique perspective i and think share so that. yeah 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 i that's think awesome. so mm -hmm. anything else you want to share <laughs> Well, I mean, uh, just very grateful for all the support always that um, people are always showing uh, and, and, and so much love and, um, you know, just, I'd just like to share that, that my journey will continue and it's only going to get more interesting and, and to, uh, if you're looking for an experience that is beyond a, um, beyond music, um, then just be on the lookout to what we're doing because that's what we're presenting and and uh, that's that's what we want to give that's the gift that we want to give to the people awesome yeah thanks brian thank you for having me my pleasure yeah.